Evening YouTube, Trevor here, Summit or Nothing, wild camping on Dartmoor. I'm in the Nature Hike Star River 2 today, and it's quite gusty, so I thought it'd be a good test in the wind to see uh, how that holds up. So we'll have a look at that. So the wind is coming in over that way, so even though I do want to test the tent to an extent, I don't want to be awake all night, have a rubbish night's sleep, so I'm going to come and camp this side of the tour, so we're a bit shielded from the wind. And this looks like a half decent area, it's not completely level, but there's not so many stones here as there is over there, so I'm going to try and pitch the tent here somewhere. Set up. Just use that on its own. We've got the, you know, the outer skin on. Now to get the inner skin put in and clipped up. Home for the night. Let's see how that holds up. It's 1.30 in the morning. Um, the tent, it's all right. It's a bit flappy. It's got those slow flaps around it, hasn't it? And the, um, yeah, those flaps around the bottom of it are for layering snow on top. If you're camping in the snow, it will stop the snow going underneath or something. But it's not snowing out at the moment, so the tent is proper flappy, really. But, but it's absolutely freezing. I've had to just put my coat on. Um, it is like, it's like winter again. Anyway, I just thought I'd report that. Back to sleep. Peace. <sighs> morning is right. Half past five in the morning. It was cold in the night. Let's have a look at it. Misty. So yeah, it's been it's nice and roomy in here. It seemed to have held up. It wasn't really much of a test of it in the wind after all, I thought it was gonna be. Just a lot of noise, those flaps. But I actually like it. I like having the side door to get in and out as opposed to the end. Well, I've got two side doors should I need them, but I suppose what I could do. Let's open this door now. And get a view of Rat Tour in the distance. The beauty of having a tent with two doors, you can just see right through there. So I can sit out taking the views from either side. Not that there's much to look at at the moment, but hopefully that mist will clear. Tor, Black Tor, Widgery Cross, coming to view. So I think about packing up in a minute. It's only been a short video. I just thought it'd be good to get the tent up, test it in some winds, but alas, there was none. So, you know, I'll try and get out for some rough weather in these tents and, and see how they bear up. Oh. 
So that was the Nature Hike Star River 2. It's a decent tent, it's roomy enough, but it does have a few faults. It's a bit flappy, as I said. Snow flaps or skirt seems to whip about in the night. You could always put some stones on there, but you know, with other tents, you don't need to do that. And it's also the crossbar is a bit of a fiddle, just makes it a little bit more awkward to set up. And also, that one end is lower than the other, just getting it the right way around when you set it up. But apart from that, Still a decent tent for the size for in the inside and the weight is it's, it's good and I reckon you could also fit two people in there. There's probably another reason why it was so cold last night. It was that I was on there in there on my own and it's a big big space to have to warm up. So I think it probably is one of those rare two-man tents that you could actually fit two men in with quite a generous vestibule on the outside to put your gear in. Anyway, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and share. We'll see you soon. Bye.